took off. I don't think I got anything on him. Hey folks, what's going on? Mr. Mom. Just wanted to make a quick video, guys, because I'm doing a little uh, rescaping, little aquascaping here in the three-gallon nano tank. Um, and I just want to talk about what I'm doing, guys, because um, lots of times, you know, you can go to a lot of stores and buy, like, uh, plant packages, Well, you know, where the stores will they'll bundle packages for you. And Fired Up Aquatics is no different, guys. We have, we have plant packages. And uh, the problem is with that, sometimes you really don't know what they're going to look like inside of a tank. You know, you have really no idea. Um, it's just kind of hard to imagine. So what I did is I went ahead and took the Mr. Mom Tanks Nano Package Tank. Um, and just, you know, escape the tank with it and, and, and see what happened and uh, see if I have to make adjustments or not. But I actually think that it's a decent package, and I'll tell you why. Because first off, um, I'm using everything that's in the package, guys, except for pearlweed. Pearlweed also comes in the package. Um, but I'm just not using it in the skate because I don't believe it's appropriate. And I also want to give people choice. So you can either use pearlweed as your foreground or you can use this dwarf hair grass, which is what I'm choosing to use. Um, you can, it comes with two bundles or two portions, whatever, dwarf hair grass. And this is actually just one, one portion that I've broken up here. Um, I still have yet to plant the other one in the front. Um, you're going to get a portion of willow moss or any moss that we decide it may be java moss christmas moss if we have it but you're going to get some moss and you see i really like this stick because the moss is growing in <laughs> really nice and this is willow moss guys we have a lot of this in the store right now and this is actually established willow moss this stuff's been growing in here probably you know two months at least and as you can see it wraps all the way around and comes all the way out of the top of the tank so uh, and then, of course, the dragonstone is awesome. It doesn't come with a dragonstone, guys. Sorry, just a plant. So get the dwarf hair grass. You're going to get pearlweed. Um, you're also going to get some narrow leaf sage, which is what this grassy stuff is here in the back. Um, it's usually, you know, in bigger tanks, it's usually like a mid-ground, maybe even a foreground plant. Uh, but in this tank, it's definitely appropriate for a background plant. So we're going to roll the narrow leaf sage. Um, we got dwarf sage over here that I incorporated on this side. And then right in the middle to break up the two rocks is the Amania gracilla. So you're going to get all these plants in the nano tank package. There's a Mr. Mom tanks pack. And there's a Jake's or J Flesh tanks nano pack. Um, and we also have some other packs up there. But I just wanted to me mention this because I'm doing the nano tank. I wanted to show you how it would actually look in an actual scape and give you an idea. And it's not done, but it's, you know, it's looking pretty good. And, and the rocks are half of it, guys, so I'll give you that. So um, you guys know where to go to get that pack if you're interested. Stargrass is looking good. I think we have some stargrass in the, in the Jake's. Uh, nano tank pack so if you're interested in some star grass maybe check that out guys so um, that's what I got for you gonna roll something out from you next in the greenhouse guys probably for you tomorrow maybe Monday we'll get some greenhouse action to you and uh, yeah let me know if you have any questions guys with will you parenthesis starting to crown J flesh tanks mr. mom tanks you know where to go guys thanks for watching peace